What is going on? Ba ba what is going on, everybody? My name is Zell Prince. Welcome back to yet another reaction. Now today I got another, <laughs> I got another Poppy Playtime video for you guys. Uh, this just came out on the same day I'm recording it, but because I already have a bunch of other videos scheduled and planned and ready to go, this video got pushed back a lot further back than I originally wanted to. But because I deleted all the other stuff, uh, thumbnail material, recorded material, so I can't change the thumbnails and whatnot. Doesn't matter. Video still. This video is still out anyway, right, guys? So, unlike the last time, I hope not to get scared like I did the last last video. Because I was too busy paying attention to a branch in the background. <laughs> and ended up getting jumped out of nowhere. <laughs> but, hopefully we're not going to go follow that same path as I did in the last video. So, we're going to go ahead and react to this. Because now it's Kissy Missy this time. And this is Restricted Relocation, August 8th, 1995, MP4. So we're going to go ahead and react to this bad boy because I've been waiting to see this since I saw it pop up yesterday. At least when I'm recording this. So we're gonna, that being said, guys, it's going to be a really short video. We're going to be starting in 3, 2, 1, go. Big, bigger buys. Well, hold on. Tape content contained unexpected... Tape contained unexpected footage tampered with by third party destroyed tape. Bigger body relocation guide. Do not continue viewing this tape. And I think that's Russian down there. So, I mean, some of it, I see. I could be very wrong. It's just a little blurry. All right, here we go. <laughs> Playtime call, com employee training number six. Bigger bodies relocation guide for eternal use only. Step one, retrieve. Giant from storage B. Chief Giant, are you talking about Kissy Missy? Hey guys. Oh, there she is. That's not terrifying at all. Please don't jump at me. Safely secure the giant. Is she awake at all? Uh, just, oh, just detailed instructions of how to restrain her. Oh, wait, here we go. Hold on, I saw something. In the event of restraint failure, observe bigger bodies, contingency plans, see playtime co policy on bigger bodies, acceptable use of force in emergency scenarios. Okay. But why did she not attack us in the sec in the second chapter? Load giant onto train. Consult the bigger. Loosen the strength binding. Stress binding the giant. Informed conductor of the intended route. This is inside the train, and there's the passcode from chapter two. Uh, release the straps binding the. Oh, it's a, it's something's glitching out. She's moving, isn't she? going so fast. Oh. Um. They're all dead. And did Kissy Missy kill them? Footage missing. Hold on a second. Why did Kissy Missy? Well, I, well actually, no, it wouldn't make sense. She is still technically a monster, but if she killed them, why didn't she kill the player in Chapter 2? Why did she help us? This raises a bunch of questions, because 
we thought, at least I th thought, Kissy Misty was one of those monsters that would help guide you into achieving your objective and getting you out of tight situations like she did in Chapter 2 when we were stuck on, on the wrong side of the gate and she opened the door for us and walked away. So, is she still hostile? And that was her attempt to help us stop uh, Mommy and Longlegs. Something to think about. Okay. So, and those models looked like models that were uh, featured in the trailer for, um, I think I just topped my mic. <laughs> that was featured in the trailer for Project Playtime. At least from what I could see. And I still have not played the game because I got nobody to play it with. Um, but that was, it was different than the last video and I didn't even get scared, even though I was scared for the fact that every time the light kept flashing in and out that she might just jump out and out and attack the train, the driver of the train, but looks like she didn't do that. And I guess she waited until the train stopped. But with that being said, guys, that was different than the last one. It wasn't particularly the... Scary, it was a little bit more unnerving. But in the future, I intend to get some, at least maybe a plushie of one of the Poppy Playtime characters. Or just some kind of merch in general. I don't know what kind. Because I've been reacting to a lot of Poppy Playtime within the last year or so since I started reacting to them. And I don't have anything to show for it. I mean, I have Fine It to Freddy, I have Hell of a Boss. Couple of other things, some horror genres I know, even though Hell of a Boss isn't exactly a hell of a horror genre. I think that one has been for that matter. More of a comedy. Yeah, cause I still have a Doki Doki uh, Yuri plushie, still still in here. But I intend to get something from Puppy Playtime. It's something I don't know what. I got to look at the store again. I am not getting a, like a six foot or a three foot uh, huggy wuggy. That that sh will scare the hell out of me. But anyway, with that being said, guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's reaction video because the next one I got in store for you is another Poppy Playtime video that's going to be coming, should be coming out around the same time. But in my um, new thing, I'm going to actually start doing a little something a little bit different when it comes to me uploading these videos. It's going to be like a background thing, not so much for edits, but what I should do in preparation for um, for some future videos. And I should be announcing... Um, Videos I've recorded and reacted to and when they would be coming out. I should be doing that because I did the same thing for my Wally -E Let's Play. But I've drawn out this outro for far too long. So I'm going to go ahead and say thank you for you guys watching today's video. Even though it came out much later than it should have. And hopefully you guys enjoyed the rest of your day. Because I know I did. Bye.